Greetings everyone, my name is Elpia Sugar Pie and welcome to this video. So, if you saw the title, or didn't see the title, it says Toys R Us is coming back. So, you're probably curious about what this video is going to be about, so let's just get right into it, <laughs> shall we? So, as you may all know, a couple months ago, our one and only favorite toy store named Toys R Us closed down on June 29th, 2018. That was a very sad day for everybody. Very a very sad day. They filed a bankruptcy in 2017, but were drowning in a $7.9 billion debt. That is a lot of money. That's a lot of money. Oh my gosh. Anyways, after receiving the news, many people were devastated because a lot of people grew up with Toys R Us. Yeah, a lot of people grew up with Toys R Us. I don't know how long Toys R Us has been around, but I know for a fact that it's been around for a very long time. So yeah, it's pretty devastating that they closed down. Um, yeah, it was really, they, the stores were huge and you could really, you could literally find any toy that you wanted. It's insane. They had almost every single toy that you wanted. <laughs> Yeah, it was really that was a really sad day. After some time, news came out that Toys R Us was coming back with a different ownership and different looking stores. So that that's pretty exciting. I mean, imagine hearing that. Like after hearing that Toys R Us is gone and they were closing all the stores down, and then later on hearing that they're opening it up again. I mean, that's like yeah, that's pretty exciting. I mean, come on. Recently, a Toys R Us store opened up on November 27, 2019, and there are actually two stores that are opened up, one in New Jersey and one scheduled to open up on December 5th in Houston, Texas. And that's actually tomorrow because today is December 4th. So that's pretty awesome. It's going to open up tomorrow. Woohoo! I can't wait. I can't wait. I mean, I'm, I don't live in Texas or New Jersey, but like, that's pretty exciting. I'm excited for those people that live near it. With these two new stores opening up, does that mean that Toys R Us is really coming back? I think so because, you know, they just opened up two stores. So, I mean, it's just the beginning. They just announced that they're coming back. And my, yeah. Yes, they've opened up two stores already, but how soon will it be that stores will be everywhere? All I can say is that I'm glad that they're trying to bring it back. Although, now that Toys R Us is coming back, some people say that there's kind of no point in having a toy store since most kids are growing up with devices to entertain them. But I don't think they realize that kids still play with toys as well as they're being collectors like everyone in the LPS community and My Little Pony community and all the other toy communities. Only thing is, with the new Kafu rule, I think that's how you pronounce it, all those communities are dying and if people who collect and make toy, I say with and without parentheses, videos leave, communities will probably die. This rule affects everyone, and if we don't do anything about it, then life will be very sad for the future months and years. So, yeah, that's great. A petition link against the COPPA rule will be provided in the description, as well as videos explaining the rule and such will be provided in the description made by the one and only awesome All Dolls. She did a great job explaining um, everything about the rule and all that, and yeah. Let's save our childhoods, everybody, shall we? <laughs> this girl is kind of ridiculous, I can say. Um, but I just think it's... I think it's just ridiculous, honestly. Because I get that these people are trying to protect the kids that are on YouTube. And I get that they don't belong on here. And they're just trying to protect them, even though they don't belong on here. I just... I think it's ridiculous that they have to punish the people who make videos with toys. I mean, because... Print with out and with parentheses toys because you know people they collect them but they don't really mean to make videos for the kids they make them for a huge variety of the audience which is you know different ages so I don't think us youtubers or LPS tubers whatever should be punished because of that you know well thank you everybody again for watching this video I just wanted to say real quick that uh, we're really close to 15,000 subscribers so if you guys haven't joined my giveaway already be sure to do so the link will be in the description um, yeah, we have 14,700 already, and yeah, we're really close to 15,000, so join before it's too late, because you're gonna miss out. <laughs> well, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!